All right, welcome back. Thank you for keeping it here. My name is Rida Kering Chabat, and you're definitely watching My Shadow Television Kenya. It's time for our education segment, and today we focus on Cardinal Otunga Mosocho Boys High School. Wana funzi Cardinal Mbele tuko pamoja. The captivating success stories of Cardinal Otunga Mosocho boys in Kisi County have captured public attention. Uh, thank you very much. Karibu sana Maisha TV. My name is Albert Ombiro, principal Cardinal Otunga High School in Mosocho. Cardinal Otunga High School Mosocho is a, an old school that has been in operation since 1961. It's a school that has produced a very good person and senior people in this country. Um, I want to thank everybody who has participated to make the school a success story, starting from the teachers present, uh, the church, the Ministry of Education officials who are really working with us very well, the TS officials, uh, the parish priest, Father Orioki, who is, present, who is, uh, who is uh, in the compound, uh, our bishop, Mairura, who was really supporting our school so much, and everybody, parents, everybody has participated to make this a school a success. It's a school with 3,000 students at the moment, and um, we, of course, we really have a challenge on a few issues on accommodation, and we are working on them. The school takes pride in the significant improvement in academic performance, which is attributed to the effective leadership of Chief Principal Mr. Albert Ombiro. Matani Albert Ondari, a teacher of chemistry, at the same time assisting the principal in the director of studies office as the director of studies. Uh, first, we thank God for the results we had last year, where we registered a mean of 9.573 which is uh, slightly below what we are targeted, I mean over 11. We thank God, we thank all the stakeholders, the parents, our main stakeholders, the Ministry of Education, the TSC, and everybody who contributed towards achieving the Summit. This year we have uh, 633 candidates who are here to register. And uh, we are targeting the still the mean of uh, 11 that we must achieve. And last year's results, we achieved it because, uh, number one, our boys were so disciplined. They were able to take serious the work they were doing with their teachers. They had their focus on their studies. Not only that, we also want to thank uh, the teachers for having a uh, cleared the syllabus early enough before March and much of the time in the year it was all about revision, revision, revision and revision. This year the strength we have is the boys are very positive because for the last few years we have had a positive result whereby all the students have always proceeded to university, minimum having B minus. And so this year the target and uh, the slogan amongst the boys minimum is a B minus and everybody is working towards achieving that. The school has been progressing consistently with the 2023 candidates class setting a new record as all students secured admission into universities with the lowest scoring a B minor grade. It's a school that uh, is performing well in KCSE. Uh, like last year, we had 432 students, and all of them were qualified to university. And we thank God and we thank everybody who has participated in the same. Uh, well, I came in here last year, 2023. and uh, My name is Yara Yera, the deputy principal of Cardinal Tunga High School, Mosocho. This is a school that was established way back in 1964. And as the general public knows, this is a school that is a powerhouse in academics, in discipline and also in co-curricular activities. Uh, for instance, in the last two years, 2023, uh, the school posted a mean of uh, 9.6. And uh, these were the distribution of the grades. A plane, we had six students. A minus, we had uh, 60 students. Uh, P plus, we had 137 students. P plane, we had uh, 203 students. And the last student had a B minus and there were 26 boys. Uh, we 
we managed to take all the students, 432 at university. Uh, the students are performing very well in sciences, in languages, uh, humanities and in the technical subjects. Moreover, Mr. Ombiro has been commended for creating conducive grounds for sporting activities at Mosocho Boys, resulting in active participation in football, rugby, hockey and other disciplines that have elevated the school's reputation nationally. It's a school that takes seriously um, co-curricular activities in the school. We have a number of activities that take place in school. We have uh, soccer, we have uh, uh, rugby, we have uh, hockey, handball, volleyball. We have uh, indoor games. They participate very well. We have been to the nationals. We have, uh, like now hockey, we were the regionals last year. And other co-curricular activities in drama, they, we normally go to the region and national. In music, our students were at the national level. And uh, we really want to bring up a, st a student who can be able to fit anywhere in our society. Uh, in the recent past, uh, we haven't been doing so well with regard to uh, sports. Uh, but then uh, we want to appreciate uh, the effort uh, that uh, the current administration and uh, the able leadership of our chief principal, uh, Mr. Albert Ombiro, he has come on board within a year and uh, he has really revolutionized the entire uh, you know, sporting activities in our school. He has really supported us with everything that we need uh, in terms of uh, the facilities, the maintenance of these facilities, and of course coming up with so many facilities uh, with regard to matters uh, games. Uh, he has enabled us to uh, attend so many tournaments and uh, our students have done well uh, in uh, those uh, tournaments. Uh, maybe uh, just to report to you uh, that uh, even uh, last year uh, when he came to our school, uh, we also did well uh, when it comes to matter sports. Uh, first time uh, we managed uh, through hockey uh, to proceed all the way to regionals and uh, unfortunately we lost at the semis. We learned from our mistakes, went back and I'm uh, guaranteeing you uh, that this year come first term uh, when we shall be having the competitions, hockey will be somewhere. Yeah, you know, in the map of uh, this country, uh, basketball will be somewhere, rugby will be somewhere. Equally, last year, second term, uh, we did well uh, with regard to rugby sevens. We managed to proceed all the way to the regionals uh, that were held at Maranda. We competed effectively, we competed well, we managed to go to the quarters. Uh, and we want to guarantee and promise you that uh, this year uh, it's a warning and is a signal uh, that you want to send uh, to our competitors out there. We are coming out strong and we shall be able to conquer uh, when it comes to matters as uh, sports in our school. Additionally, Cardinal Lutunga Mosocho Boys boast of a vibrant journalism club which has been nurtured and supported by the school administration. Amweza kukita kule kambi anamengi ya kutujiri. Serikali metuma wito kwa kila mmoja wao ili waweze kuzingatia usalama barabarani. Ningependa kutoa wito kwa wanajamii hususan madereva kutotumia vileo wanapokuwa barabarani. Our reporter Duncan is in Kisi County. Kisi town and municipality at large, it is going to be in a state of dilemma because there is not going to be enough of money to, to run the, the, the programs that are issued in the place. No, things are evolving and we need to nurture boys in the best way, not only in terms of books but also in terms of what can help them mint a coin in the near future. And that is why we always encourage them that do not sit on your talent, practice your talent and they always say that practice makes perfect and we are a school that takes in boys and gives out society men who are of substance. The discipline and hard work exhibited by the students have been instrumental in the school's success across all aspects of learning. We know very well that there is a very thin line between discipline and academics. Students cannot perform if they don't be, uh, behave well. Students cannot perform if they don't know God. So with God, the discipline of the students, which is apt, then uh, we are set to go as a school. Mr. Umbiro acknowledges the overwhelming support from stakeholders, which has been a pivotal in the school's achievement. First of all, I'm proud of everything in this school. I'm proud of the facilities, I'm proud of the students, I'm proud of the teachers. I'm proud of the challenge I've been given. Now that Kainotunga is a school that is performing well, 
it really gives me a challenge. Um, the kind of unity I'm seeing among the staff, the kind of determination, the kind of discipline I'm seeing this, uh, with the students, it really gives me a lot of hope. And uh, I know with the time, it will be the greatest ever school found in Kenya. For Masha Prime, Masha Television, I'm Rita Kering Chebet.